Hello everyone! This is Creating Grin. Hi. Join us as we play Dungeons and Dragons, the fifth edition, around ye old table, throwing dice, telling stories, and creating legacies. With me as always, the Crit Crew. To my left we have... Uh, I'm Brian. I play Imon Drevin, the aquatic half-elf bard paladin. And... Uh, He's still trying to figure out what the hell is going on with the old dude in his head. Uh, mm -hmm. Very confused about apparently there is a prophecy. So that's that's fun. That's fun. That's great. <laughs> and I have a uh, Jason. I'm playing Knox, a changeling assassin rogue. Uh, still kind of coming to grips with the finger that I was gifted. <laughs> <laughs> trying to come up with a uh, you know a, a, a gift. To return in sorts. <laughs> uh, and I forgot my dice, so I have now got cursed dice. And we have a total party kill coming. Oh, oh, great. Again. Again. <laughs> oh, I no, it wasn't die. normal. I didn't die. <laughs> Third <laughs> time's the charm. I'll be on the inside. Uh, my name's Katie, playing Ilias Eidelwind, a Air Genasi Druid, who is also totally rocked by this prophecy thing and is now stressing over the fact that he has to somehow keep all of his friends alive until our friends get back from their other realm. <laughs> wow. Uh, I'm Maria. I'm playing Real to Farseeker, a uh, drow ranger, and um, she's just still pretty enamored at the moment. Can't really focus <laughs> on much. Just happy to be alive again. And that... Somebody else is alive too. I'm Ashley. I'm playing Runa, the Tabaxi fighter cleric, and uh, also just you know, not, nothing's re really odd happened. It's just like a normal Tuesday. <laughs> and I'm Eric, and I will be your Grin Master or GM for this chapter of our tale, which shall be labeled Chapter Thirty Nine. What's next? So, last we left off, you had encountered the interesting characters, or, uh, yeah, interesting characters is the best way to put it, of uh, Uncle and Twilight, who seem to travel from a different universe, a multiverse, or something like that. And uh, you found out that uh, they may play a little bit more of a role. And uh, you guys helped thwart away uh, a few enemies and bad guys, helped them out, and now they have returned back from whence they came. Yeah. And, go uh, XP, level up a bit. and uh, you guys have been granted a new level, so you sh all should be a level 11 at this point. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to turn it over to you guys <laughs> to figure out what you want to do. So, uh, as the chapter says, so what's next? <laughs> the universal solvent. Yes, you did oh, require yeah. the what universal happened? solvent. Yeah. Oh yes. Yeah. All right. Open so then, stupid box. Then, yeah, we'll we'll pull out this random black case that we've had since the backstory. One. <laughs> I'm very, very just like, why is and, everyone uh, so excited about? Uh, I don't even really know what the black case is. We're over here like we don't eyes. So it's excited. it's a fairly long case. I'd say three and a half, four feet, maybe a little Where bit longer. Where were you putting fitting this? Well, you know, you don't want to know. It is a very dark <laughs> ebony wood. <and laughs> There is no like latches, <laughs> locks, or anything. It's just basically two pieces of wood sandwiched together with uh, what is it? Uh, the glue. What is it called? I, I, don't, I don't remember. Super, superb, <laughs> superb glue. Yeah, just questioning the uh, physical anatomy of your species. And <laughs> yep. <laughs> Let me look it up in you old DMs, guys. Sure. Backpack. Is that what you? That's what they call it. Maybe anyway, it was magical glue. <laughs> For those of you out there, you can shame. I bet it was magical. Glue. Maybe they're marsupials. <laughs> um, yeah. So what are you guys gonna do? Yep. What's what's going on? Let's solve it. Are we solving this? Uh, yes, we are. We'd like we're to finally solve this. Okay. Solvent. <laughs> Who's doing it? <laughs> 
Ilias will cry. <laughs> 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 Do it. Bonus action. Bonus action. So go, it, it transitions from I'm on over to Ilias, maybe back, and then... <laughs> no, you do it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got this. You got this all of it. Are they afraid to pour liquid on the box? Look, we found you this box. I don't know what's in the box. <laughs> we found this box along with wyvern eggs. So you might have a new pet. Oh my god, I'll open the box. Elias <laughs> <laughs> is going to hold the box and be like, here, you can put this no, on the box. No, no, <laughs> no. I just got us back. You aren't doing anything that seems dangerous, but my darling. I guess the nature of this is yes, how we can, are we even if they do it. solve it on there? Is there Rubbing skill the or is it like <laughs> precision to put it on there? Or like, what are we doing? Oh, here, here let me pull out my little squirt bottle. Just like. <laughs> yeah, like, what are you gonna, what are you, how are you gonna do it? How much how we just we have naughty tabaxi up uh, in the uh, you oh, okay. There's like a seam on it, right? Correct. When so sh- in which I'm pretty sure I'm on and you I discovered. To, like, Correct. Fuck with. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Um, I guess just like. Jeez, guys, if you drop solvent along the edge and try okay. and like but, let it soak in. So here, here's what we'll do. Go ahead and give me a. Oh, um, what do we call? Let's just make it a straight dex oh, check. Do just a straight dex check. Let's see how check. nimble you are, like, or you, if you accidentally knock over the bottle and waste the solvent. Would Would you like sure to be blessed? Yeah. Hashtag blessed. Hashtag blessed. Hashtag Yep. Yep. For me, new cleric abilities. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> I really like hashtag this. Are we? Are we never gonna find out? <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna tear you. up these papers I've had for seven or eight. I got months a or. whole grand total of seven. <laughs> Oh, here's oh, that's not that's not terrible. Ten was the target. I'll say you do it, but you waste the entire bottle. You didn't have to waste the entire bottle, but you do. Oh, she didn't waste it. I saw nothing happening, and I took the bottle and just poured it. There you go. Okay, <laughs> that's great. Right. Move. So this it finally loosens up enough to where you can pull this off, and it's like a rushing nesting doll. There's actually another box inside there that has more solvent, that has a, or more glue. No, I'm just kidding. I would, I would throw it on the ground. And when anger. when you pull Pull this massive, this lid, this wooden lid off uh, to finally reveal what's inside. It is a, um, it's it's like a purple velvet, purple velvet lined tray. Resting inside this tray is a unique, beautiful looking long sword. And in the center of like where the cross fighter, uh, what is that Literally called? The cross fighter. would be the cross guard. I guess is is that the technical term? Yeah, I wanted. To <coughs> there, it looks like some sort of like marble or jewel that has a swirling purple energy in it. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you what this thing looks like. Pass that down. Mm-hmm. Don't look. Don't okay. peek. Don't look. Don't, don't, don't peek. peek. Don't look. Don't peek. Since you were the first one to reveal it, you can show everybody you want. <laughs> This is finally the item that I had crafted <coughs> with our friends at Arcane Artifacts. Thank you, Arcane Artifacts. Thanks, Arcane Artifacts. This is 39. 39 episodes. Yeah. Sword and... Sword. Anyway. <laughs> so here's, here's this. So here is the statistics. <laughs> I, will, I will cast identify. Pass the stats on down it. to oh. the Keeper of the Sword. Well, I will cast identify on it so we can get... Identify. It does a lot of things. Can I see it? We'll put a picture up. I got some okay. high quality pictures we can put in after post. Mm-hmm. So now you have a Marshall. long sword that has. Feather. Yeah. That's kind of cool. So as Ilias is studying this weapon and the rest of you see him doing that, also don't forget he has a big plethora of feathers that form a beard from a mishap with mild magic. Oh, Oh, I remember. (laughs) Mm -hmm. I'm starting the the feather beard's growing on me. Oh, thanks. It apparently growing on you, too. Uh, Anyone can use a longsword, question mark? I can. I sure can. I can. I mean, I, I can, but I really don't need any more <laughs> shenanigans. Ars <laughs> Gravitas? Correct, Gravitas. yes. Ars Gravitas. 
Slumpin yeah, so for those of you watching and or sitting at the table, if you want to check his thing, it's like a series of like oh, I guess five or six like weapons. I read it out loud instead of just <laughs> yeah. looking at the paper, my bad. Yeah. So it's, a, it's an obsidian longsword forged in the depths guess. by an ancient race long forgotten. Its hilt is outfitted with a pulsating purple gem, hinting at the weapon's latent power. Plus one attack uh, and damage. It's five charges, regains all at dusk. Um, you can expend for Featherfall, Magnified Gravity, and Gravity Sinkhole um, as it um, progresses, I'm guessing. Like Black Hole? Kind the of. spells is kind of like that. That's and this sick. is kind of the slumbered version. There's a, okay. there's a nice. more... Yeah, there's a more awakened version on there too, I think. Yeah, you have, you have, uh, well, no, you just have the activated abilities and what they do. Mm -hmm. Well, you haven't Correct. awakened. Yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Said weapons. Wake me up. So, yeah, um, well, yeah. Okay. <laughs> it feels extremely balanced, it feels very well crafted. I've been this, carrying this for forever. I'm take it. Hey, I carried it while you were dead. <laughs> but here you go, I don't want this. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. How tall am I? Huh? Oh, I'm yeah. A, I'm not, he's, he's a half elf. He's like 5'10. Okay, okay. Like, he's, he's not. So I'm not going to lie. I really wanted it to just be like slowly dragging me. <laughs> 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 he's good. How tall is Ilias? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I love how we just didn't even know. Two. Oh, he's tall. Five, five, five he's tall. tall. You eat Correction, tall. episode 39, height comparison. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's been a great we episode. We we'll see you next week. Black box well, to like, find a finally, pulsating weapon. Finally <laughs> got the size. Roll for size. He looks like 46 now. Because <laughs> he like got aged. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> So you stand okay. there after right, um, your newfound friends had left. I'm visibly upset yeah. that there is not a wyvern. We're not wyvern eggs in there. I'm darling, 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 sorry. darling. I promise when we survive this, we'll get as many pets as you like. Okay. I mean, did you see that big, tall, giant guy? He just like was riding the thing. Literally, Flakes is going to be behind all. <laughs> <laughs> and we head back to the city. Oh uh, yeah. Like, see if they're dying. Well, the 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 Demi Gorgon went off. Okay, well, yeah, like, let me was, clarify this yes. for those of you who Seven. have been watching, because I've been doing all my rewatchings and notes and things. <laughs> the party traveled west. I'm retconning this to clarify. The Demigorgon went to the east. Just so we're all on the same oh, page good. here. Good, good. I like it that way. A whole yeah. lot in between us. Actually, let's go to Because I'm pretty sure in we'll the episode, one of the episodes, I literally screwed up and said, oh, everybody's went west the same direction. It's not, I'm sure. I'll have Brian make sure he puts a flashing thing. East. Morning, morning. <laughs> There's lies. So we are lies, all on the same lies. page. Lies. The ah. beast, the prince of demons, went to the east carving a path, Nothing and you guys had went to the west, away from the city a little bit, to kind of help the uh, two, un both Uncle and Twilight. Oh, good. So he's he's on his way to the other three terrible things. But yeah. Perfect. Yeah, Lovely. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where were the other terrible things? Well, there's... So there's one like on on the the, the continent of. Would you like a world map? Oh, like, yes. like, give me a world map here. Uh, world map, man. World map it and for our for our viewers. For our not, viewers, we'll, I well. remember. But welcome to, to welcome to the world. What is, what is I'm this? map challenged. Welcome in to the world social study. Welcome to social studies. Yeah. So <laughs> so we're all the way over here. We're east. Listen, and for you kids out there watching, yes, pay attention to school so you can read a map. It's very important you play your D&Ds. Yeah, we're the far most eastern, Hashtag from your left from your eastern right. continent in, in the continent <laughs> of Stygian. And one of the uh, bad things is all the way over here in the continent of Solaris. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, it's labeled. It's got its own it's, label on the map. It's got a label, yes, a tree. tree of needles. Uh -huh. um, which was Treedle. It's we literally talk, the talk miniature over there. Work. See that big miniature that looks like a tree <coughs> that's like 14 inches tall? That's yeah. the tree of needles. Yeah, tree. 
Yep. Let me need someone to hide that from time. him. It's a sovereign glue. Uh, what? Wait, I didn't say uh, sovereign glue. Thank you. Um, and, moving on. And then, and then, <laughs> if I remember I'm correctly, to remember how old I was now. somewhere in the scaled <laughs> islands. That is correct. Which is over here, mm -hmm. most likely Red Scale Island, where there's a little dragon icon. What? what? Oh my gosh! It's, it's like seven, seven years ago dragon. when I made this. I knew what I was doing. <laughs> the ancient dragon. God He's been toying with us ever since. Has correct. It's been job. Literally, currently slumbered. That's so. what I'm not paid to do. <laughs> so I'm yeah. unpaid. So we're we're all the way over here. So and I. Demigorgon is now just gonna walk through up the in sea. my. Wonderful. But he's going old east. Mountainous. Oh wait, no, yeah, he no, went east. We good. went west. Right. I, we can just look see. It's not so easy. Look at the map. Um, like Pete, you well, guys I mean, got this right. If you go, keep no, exactly. Keep You're right. Yeah, yeah. that's good. We said we're getting married to help. No, no, we're getting married to run away. Flat, flat world. So we're making a small round. Oh, okay. We're we're on a okay. So we're on a we're on a flat square. We are flat square. Fishers. No, we're a so, ball. So Solaris is round, three dimensional. Yeah, not not Arctica is the ice shelf. Though, right? <laughs> nice. Uh, so Arctica. he went east. So he's heading towards Greymore and Rosehold, and we'll run in that direction. That. Correct. Great. And we went none of those west. sound okay. like very good places to go. So no. Let's vacation really somewhere doesn't. else. Pleasant place like Thornmist. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Sounds spicy. Um, okay, so... This is my gothic horror content, I'm just letting you guys know. <laughs> Great. Nice. Super stupendous. Okay. So, we'll so, just uh, run around and explore. That so head cool. back to, to the, 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 the city, I guess, and then make our way... Downtown. Yeah. <laughs> make, make it away. There's yeah, no downtown. more downtown. It got destroyed. Uh, yeah, that's probably true. More it's uptown it's girl. Downtown. 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 Okay. It's a downtown. So, I'm pretty Cold sure downtown. it was uh, <laughs> several hours back. Yeah. East. You guys will begin to traverse. Uh, what's your marching order? I'll go first. Leading the way. I'm also first. Yeah. Slightly behind. Side We're by holding side. Hands. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Who is behind? We're off to see the wizard. Me. We already saw okay. the wizard. That's right, we're leaving from the wizard. Who's behind Knox? I'll be behind Knox. Okay. Then I'll, I'll take up the rear. And Flakes will be... As I'll far away from, from us. <laughs> Flakes will be kind of like in between Ilias and... Uh, Wait, doesn't Flakes have some kind of crush right now, too? Yeah, and the queen. Mm-hmm, yeah. Well, On the queen? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Flakes and the queen. I'm gonna figure out a way to get place in the queen. Yeah, yeah. They got a little friendly. Apparently, please see the little side quest episodes that was is on our YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. Yes, they need some views. <laughs> <laughs> I'm begging you. They were pretty good. For they were. They for were little, really for good. A little, for a little side quest. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They were pretty good. Um, yeah. All right. So I need a survival check from whoever's leaving. Leading. I'll help you, and you can have advantage. Good. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not. No. Mm -mm. Not We're good. too 13. wrapped up in our love. Yeah. Jesus. Oh, <laughs> I guess not all the flowers. I got 13. I mean, it's not like. 13's not awful. bad. Yeah. There's like, don't, you know. I can't go blindly. I'm not just like close my eyes walking through the forest with my Shh. senses. That's a game we play at night. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Anybody else want to do it? <laughs> Can I uh, look around and see if Mr. Large Man decided to come back this way? Oh, yeah. You you can make a perception check. <laughs> Sir Large I'm going to clap at his suggestion. <laughs> oh, I was rolling. 19! No, did not oh. come back this way. Sick. So you guys, after, like I said, several hours of travel, you guys will make it back to the outskirts of the city. Uh, you will see that they are still kind of doing the whole you know cleaning up uh searching for survivors uh establishing kind of camps and places uh, of safe refuge for survivors um the vibrant colors of the fae have dwindled down to very dull somewhat muted colors except for like the rifts or the kind of um, 
crags of like glowing energy that is the ley lines or the weave of magic that's kind of wild that is altering everything they're very vibrant and bright um so yeah you're back into the city what's next now it's getting close to a long rest as you guys have traveled way out and then way back mm-hmm. long rest sounds good um should we check on the queen no we should have our friend check on the queen oh that's me yes i i can yes yes i can Mm -hmm. yeah i'll do that i will check on the queen and make sure that the children i saved are safe is what she's okay make sure you give her a big old smooch on the mouth for me that's what we do to greet each other because i'm her you know guard that's how we greet each other. I'll say her little whiskers kind of flutter a little bit. <laughs> and then she <she'll laughs> kind of she'll kind of like pounce. Is that oh. how the backseat blush? Yes. Okay. <laughs> she will make her way in the direction of wherever the queen may be. Seems not right. <laughs> <laughs> That's uh you know that little tingle when you're excited? Not gonna just look like <laughs> <this. laughs> <laughs> Y'all started it with a big black box, okay? Hey, look, you know what? It's been it's been downhill ever since. Um, we started, started a couple, couple of <laughs> and we've just been digging down. Yeah. So, I would like to uh, try and uh, communicate with a uh, grumpy old dude in the head. You can, yeah. Perfect. So, mm, yeah, mm, mm. what is it you want? Well, what, what's your story? How, how'd you get stuck in, in my head? I mean, that's uh, usually people will wine and dine me before they just do that. I mean, I can go and get us some wine and, and some food. That the would be nice. I, haven't, <laughs> <laughs> I have not had the taste of wine in uh, so many years, is what I'll say. Can you taste what I taste? Pretty much. Okay. Neat. <laughs> and I will go and find some wine. Okay. Go <laughs> <laughs> pick up some Easy wine. enough, you will find some, and mm-hmm. you will be able to do that. What is it that you wish to know, is what he says. Well, um, I, I, I'm kind of confused on how there's two of you that then got stuck in my head by using a single tablet that disappeared. I'm trying to figure that one out. But the, the tablet didn't disappear. What do you mean the tablet didn't disappear? The tablet didn't. The tablet. You have the tablet. Mm-hmm. The tablet didn't disappear. I thought the tablet disintegrated. No. no. We can talk to the tablet. Oh, that's, oh that's, right. Right. that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do I have the tablet? That's right. Sorry. Uh, I think I have the tablet. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Either you or Bruno have the tablet. If you would have had the tablet, we've just been whispering. So if you go to look for the tablet, it'll be right back there. It'll just right back to. Oh, okay. Did you give it back to him? No, he probably took it. He did. I don't know him. Welcome to my cursed artifact. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. I don't know. My mom's not really much of a thief. I don't really know what to take. Uh-huh. Maybe the guy in his head so, did it. So did <laughs> Maybe the like, guy in his head did it. Did you try resurrecting Ooh, someone and, and him, it like, failed and him? you got yeah. stuck? And no, I was experimenting it. with various artifacts. That's what he'll say. I'm a wizard. You're a wizard. Yes, I'm very much a wizard. <laughs> You're a wizard. And, and My name you is Lorian Bright, is what he'll say. <laughs> really? <laughs> Lorian Bright. Why do you find that funny? It's my name. We can't hear you. I at least can't hear you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lorian Bright, okay? And, and, and I don't know, Runa and Bruder are on the other side, like, trying tablet. to decide if you're possessed or not. Like, yes, I, I have, uh, one of my hobbies is to collect various trinkets, baubles, artifacts, and off. things, and documentate how they work. Unfortunately, this crafty little device <coughs> is, uh, a little bit more than I was, ex- uh, prepared for, is what I'll say. Mm-hmm. So you were experimenting with it, got stuck in it. Pretty much. And then uh, when when I was resurrected, you now are in my head. I'm kind of bound to this thing currently, is what I'll say. So you, 
So this is a verbal communication. Oh, I'm or, speaking out loud. Okay. Because okay. as far as I know, that's the only way it works. Like literally, Correct. we're, we're literally over here just like Correct. one side yeah. of a conversation. Yeah. Correct. Okay. You, so you went off to find wine though. Like, did you come back to oh, where yeah. we were? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just randomly drinking from a bottle. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay. Yeah. This does not seem healthy. Are you are you good? I don't know you very well, but are you good? I am very confused. I apparently have, you know, uh, two individuals in my head. Um, How did you fit an individual in your head? <sighs> my great aunt had that happen to her. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how you do. Th- I don't. I'm not a big magic well. person, and I don't understand how you pe- get peoples in your head. Sorry. They're imaginary people. Oh, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. I don't. I don't think that's how. It's, I'm not it's, imaginary. It's, it's, yeah, they're, they're not imaginary. It's, it's also, you know, your, your buddy, Thaleth. He's, he's Thaleth's like, inside of your I'm head. I'm going to walk up yes. and, like, pat your hand and be like, it's okay. That's what we've told Aunt Margaret, too. <laughs> or, I'm sorry, not Aunt Margaret. Won't she be? So, yeah. so Thaleth was very impressed with how Ice easily <laughs> and how well you just assassinated somebody <laughs> in, in the underground. What? What? Yeah. Why are you telling me about it? Runa assassinating somebody in the underground. Oh, it was epic. It was very impressive. It was yeah. super we probably killed, killed the wrong one. person, <laughs> if we're being like, honest. Delayeth was very impressed with that. <laughs> Let Delayeth know that he inspired me. To anyway, we were having okay. a conversation. So, <laughs> quiet down, Delayeth. It's my turn. <laughs> uh, okay, yes, yes, yes. Sorry. Uh, Lorian Bright. Um, yes. Correct. So... Oh, Lorian Bright is the name of his imaginary friend. I'm okay, so going to call him Dorian at some point. I hope Dorian. you know. <laughs> Dorian? Really? Because no, all I hear is Lorian Bright, is what he says. <laughs> or or do it, you know, the name familiar to anybody at all? or uh, You can make a history check. Okay. Sure. Is this whole body inside of your head? No. 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 Just Where's his Seven. body? Good question. Probably gone by now, is what he'll say. He what says probably mean? gone by now. I haven't heard of it. Where, what ha- what happened to Delay this body? It, it went to die. It just vanished. And smooshed into, into the tablet. And then, I guess, into your brain. So Maybe it is inside your body now. Do we think it's like a ghost? Is he hey. possessed by a ghost? Would <laughs> the no tablet idea. be considered part of him? <laughs> part of who? Delay it. No. Oh, darn. <laughs> so, <laughs> 8 on the history. You had a 23 on history? Yep. 21. 21? Mind you, I'm from the boondocks of an icy mountain. I'm yeah. from a port town. <laughs> <laughs> um, he must with those numbers, I'm going to say that you guys would have heard each one of you a slightly different tale. Okay. But enough to figure out that it's speaking of the same group. Like Johnny Appleseed. You're, hmm. there, that's exactly right. Hey. Um... So each one of you would have heard growing up the tale of six adventurers that was around during the Great Surge, or the Surge, which was kind of talked about in season one. Check it out. Uh, Who actually dealt and thwarted with these creatures or monstrosities and kind of like made them vanish or dead. The 23 is going to get you enough to know that they were called the Wardens of Solaris. And you would know that one of them was a (coughs) middle-aged wizard of chronomancy named Lorien. And that's what you guys have built. Wait, did you say Lorien? Yeah. Like uh, like from like the warden of Solaris. See, she gets it. Is what you'll hear. Uh, apparently, yes. Oh, yes, so there were six of us. There were six of them. One of you, you've met. One of them, you've met. Wait, I met yeah, one wait. of them. Yes. Who, who, who did I? The one, the one before you when you, the one that was being helped by the. The necromancer is what he says. He sounds confused. Like I'm, li- I'm like role playing this out. Like yeah, he, the, okay, the, the one that was, the one that was being helped by the, the necromancer, the attractive female, the druid, the, the druid. Celest- Wait, Celestina? Celestina? Yes, that's her name. Is what he's going to say. <laughs> yes, he's- we've met another one. We've met two. They're my <laughs> idols. 
I'm gonna come up and start vig- vigorously shaking your hand again. Ooh. Such an honor to meet you. Stop. Stop. It's, <laughs> yep. Please. Very You're gonna make him seasick. That's not necessary at all. Um, okay, so. I mean, I guess she did help bind the demo, whatever nonsense. Yeah, she did help oh. bind it. She did. Uh, and then everybody can make a. Oh, I don't know. What to do. Let's just do like a straight wisdom. Just a wisdom check when all this starts coming out to see if anything starts clicking. Unless you know. What if my passive is much higher than that? No. I mean, <laughs> I personally have an idea. Then? I don't know if Ilias would... Well, I, I have two potential thought processes. One... <laughs> you have a lot of thought processes <laughs> in your head. <laughs> you you know. have three. That's a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I might need to upgrade that computer. Right, cool. <laughs> Let's go off to my right. So we'll start with Runa. What you got, Runa? 14. Mm. I'm too excited. Yep. Fangirling. Four. Right mm. Somebody's fangirling mm. harder than I am. Nine. Not no. for that person. Uh, uh, two minus one for one. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, but I have... Uh, you, you, what, what is chronomancy? It's the ability to manipulate time. Remember when we had the conversation about multiverse? Y- okay, the conversation... Wait, you and I didn't have a conversation about the multiverse. Yes, we did. If you go back and check the multiverse, we did. We had a conversation about the multiverse. Yes, I remember when I said, hey, do you know anything about the multiverse? And you're like, no. And he's like, oh, never mind. I'm not going to talk about it then. That's, That's not really a conversation. That explains why we never had a conversation. <laughs> I mean, I... L- okay. Anyway, that's what he's going to say. Okay, wait, what's his name again? Okay. Lorian. Lorian Bright. Okay, so... so two the greatest protomancy... Wizard ever. We can't hear this, so it doesn't yeah. matter. <laughs> <laughs> I am not saying that. <laughs> yeah. um, okay, Lorian Bright, the greatest chrono <laughs> ever. What <laughs> can you do? Nothing of inside of this tablet is hmm? what he's going can to be say. Yes. Anyway, there's there is <laughs> six of us. Okay, there's six of you. Yes, you, one of them Celestina. is Celestina. Correct. And A wizard named Albus. Albus. Oh, yes. Dang, we don't know one. Yeah. I've heard we don't know that. that one. We don't know that. A ranger named Tenet. Do I have any ranger lore? You just send like, away the one that would. What? <laughs> uh, you could, you know, uh, I don't know. Like, I'll tell you what, down, yes, like ranger yes, camp? go ahead and give me a history check. <laughs> go ahead and give me a history check, because you trolled around in the underdark. You said it was Tenet. Oh my god. Tenet. We're dead. We're dead like tonight, David you guys. Like David Tenet. T-E-N-N. A and T, I think. A five. <laughs> nah, nah, you're too worried about mushrooms. I mean, you know, I'm killing my college is important to me. Albus, the what? Albus was a wizard. Albus or is a wizard. wizard. But yes, yes, he is. There's six of them. Wizard. He is a professor. So head. These He's things are finally getting to come to fruition. At the long, this is a long game here for me. <laughs> you're welcome. There's a sorcerer named Almasith, Is what he'll say. One of scales, dragonborn. Ow, mace. A little crazy, is what he says. If you're saying that, born what? Sorcerer? Mace. Sorcerer. Dragonborn, sorcerer. A little crazy. The hell's the point? No, I'm from the yeah, You would know. They may not. Okay. They may have heard of it, but they've never seen one, I would assume. Or okay. if they have, it's very rare. And the final one is someone like your friend there, as he kind of. You know the furry one? Oh. Uh, yeah. Excuse me? Flurry of Blizzard. Yeah, I can't hear. What's his name? Of, yes. Flurry of Blizzard. <gasps> Correct. I wonder if that person's related to Flakes. Flurry of Blizzard. Wait a second. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Saw the light bulb Wait. kick on. <laughs> Wait, the Blizzard that I know from my hometown? Which would be your. Yeah, tribal elder. That's right. Yes, I'll fill in sure. The blank. I couldn't remember if he was the commander or not. I was like, he is the tribal elder, elder okay. correct? Flurry of Blizzard. So if that said, you would be able to tie that together. Okay. We were known as the Wardens of Solaris, <coughs> is what I'm saying. Okay. So, like, do we need to get the band back together, or well, I know where to find Flurry? I don't even Blizzard. know if the band is still alive. I've only seen I, the one Celestina. Is what I'm saying. She didn't, quite, Blizzard is she didn't quite care for me too three. much. Albus, we think is maybe I don't know. You, you don't. Where's know. You, you guys have never we met Albus. Know. I thought Sindra and like 
mentioned him or something. She did. Saying. She did, but you got... She mentioned, but... Sure. Oh, okay. Right. Well, Mm, well, is there, do you know of a way, does he know of a way to, like, eat him out of the tablet? No, I've been working for years. Hmm? Hundreds no. or so. Apparently he's been working for hundreds of years. Wait, hundreds of years? How, wait, how long did Tabaxi live? Hundreds of years? They sure. Nine lives. When, <laughs> that's true. Fact. Um, canon. <laughs> now canon. When, when was the surge? That was, like... Not. A long time ago. Several hundred years like ago. Several hundred years ago. Yeah. Okay, so Celestine and I. Probably close to 500, maybe. 9 times 70. 630. <laughs> what? How did you math? <laughs> you just do 9 times 7 and then add a 0, right? <laughs> You're asking me to do 9 times 7. <laughs> Stay in school, kids. Stay in school. <laughs> okay, so. so so you're saying that the guy, the flakes guy, the blizzard man, is like nine million years old? I mean, oh not that God. old. That's the like, like, like lady witch that lives like across the mountain peak. Okay. She is really old. So you there's a can there's be like five hundred years old. That's pretty close. Was my, my next question? Like, I'm gonna be really old. Probably if I don't die, you know, in this whole situation. <laughs> We're not reaching those. I'm going to say that Delayth is going to be like, there's a lot of math on the walls here. The, yeah. It's because, like Pepe Julio. Yeah, <laughs> literally trying to figure out formulas and everything. And so, so a beautiful mind. Okay. It's literally, so here's what Delay is say. To give you a perspective, this is a 25 by 25 foot stone room with no windows, doors, or access, ceiling, and floor. And there's a lot of scribble everywhere. And he's really annoying. That's what he's going to say to you. Okay. That's what your mind is so, like. I'm just a yeah, skill oh, yeah, that's, 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 that's <laughs> what's going on in my head. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay. So, question, Lauren. Did you do some weird, weird multiversal shit on, like, Flurry of Blizzard and, like, Celestina and all of them to, like, make them live long? I told you I like to tinker with some things and collect artifacts, is what he's going to say. Yes. Oh, so I wonder if we, like, introduced yourselves <laughs> to Celestina or, like, reunited them, would she be able to maybe, like, Yoink him? yeet, yeet, guy delete your, from your head kind of situation? Or at least maybe, I don't know, maybe she's got like an old chronomantic tool laying Wait, does around. does that mean you can, like, harness chronomancy? No. Don't be <laughs> fools what he's going to say. I feel like I am, I feel like I am like three seconds older, uh, though. Right, me too. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm magical. Cro uh, chronomancers do have the ability to manipulate time, yes. And when you get pretty, as you would say, high in level, to keep it simple for you, is what he'll say. When, when you become advanced enough in chronomancy, apparently you can manipulate time. Correct. The next step um, is to start playing around with the multiverse, but we won't get into that. Oh, we just thought Blurry was, like, so stubborn. He was never going to die. To mean to die. I mean, I get that. Yeah. yeah. My mm -hmm. dad. That's too, my dad. Too mm -hmm. stubborn to die. Okay. That's what anyway, thought. yes. Any more questions? So um, many more questions. I mean, a few, yes, since I have you in my head. Go ahead. Uh, like, uh, what, like your what the color? hell did you do to banish and capture the Demigorgon? Well, <laughs> well, there well. is a lot of magics and spells that went into doing that. You have to soften them up enough, is what it'll say, and we actually use the Wells of Magic as a way to kind of, like... <coughs> Tether him in and force him into his prison, if you will. Okay, so lots of high-level magic. Yep. Also harnessing the wells of magic that run through the entire world. Which you Don't let Lilius near them. That's what he's going to say. Hey! Only one <laughs> no. that the Demigorgon <laughs> called out of beard? that you captured him. I don't know. <laughs> it's the only one that's been broken, yes. as far as I know. So far. Good point. Ah. <laughs> uh, fuck. Yep. Okay, so that's not gonna work. I mean, wells of magic are kind of like... How do I put this? 
Oh, Hydra heads. You cut one off, one or two more appear somewhere, is what he'll say. Hmm. The magic has to go somewhere so it forms okay. another. It's like it's oh, yeah. pocket energy. Can't be deleted. Okay, okay, okay. Um. Typically, civilizations will build cities over or different ways to protect them so people don't get crazy and try to. Jump in and harness all the magic. It's like you read your history book on the surge. Very good. Um, can you ask him if. Uh, we bring this information to Celestina, will it be received well, or is she going to be like, hell no? Um, I can hear her. Yeah. She doesn't like me very much, but she probably would acknowledge that, yes, I existed and traveled with the group, is what he says. They're not on great terms. I, I, mean. I may have tried to get friendly with her a few times, but she didn't appreciate that. Is he's an asshole? I'm not an asshole. <laughs> he made advances that were not. Oh, uh, so he's an asshole. <laughs> yes. Okay. Her beard looks stupid. That's what you'll hear. Or his beard looks stupid. Sorry. Consent is mandatory in this uh, guild or this group of adventurers. Team sad. <laughs> Team sad. Team sad. Okay. Still might be worth talking to Celestina, though. Um, not specifically about. I don't want to hide anything from her. She seems but very scary. She, she is. <laughs> Maybe she find is. the wells? Uh, yeah, I mean, apparently some new wells might be popping up. Um, that might be something to, you know, uh, let, let Sandra know about and if she's not already aware. I got a stick. You got a stick. Stick. Baboons have Thank sticks, you. is what you'll hear. <laughs> What'd you say? Baboons, Baboons. have sticks. <laughs> Uh, Baboon. Then, yes. As our um <laughs> Yes. Gotta um, step of dowsing. Yeah. Just as like a um Yes, you do. Yeah. That will find magicals. Um it does. I'm gonna I cast guess. or attempt to cast dancing lights because I don't I wanna know if our magic is like effy or whatever. Sure. No, that's a good idea. Yeah. You go ahead and cast it Boop. and uh, roll me a D twenty for casting it. <laughs> oh god, it's been so good so far. A ten? Everything worked out to your advantage. Sick. Feels right. I'm just te- just testing just to see. I don't, you know, it's been kind of weird lately. You never know. Um. Well, I wonder what like, he, what are. He seems like he doesn't really have any ideas, just information. Well, it's but gotta I'm, have our I have our ideas and I'm trapped inside of time. What do you suggest that? What does he suggest we like do to help him? Or you? Mostly you. I'm more worried about maybe like getting the layup back to fabrication. You know, like in real life. Yeah, the, I mean, that would be the ideal to get both of them out of my head, which apparently they're not actually in my head. No, we're in the tablet. They're actually in the tablet. And you're connected to the tablet. So I wonder if like... I have a connection to the tablet because it was used to resurrect me. Will you get sucked in if they get sucked out? (laughs) Yes. Yes, apparently. Here's how I figured out. His, excuse me, Delay. He says, kind of, you hear Delay. Like, oh, <laughs> let me get over to this wall. Hmm. Okay, here's how I figured it out so far. There was another person here before I got in here. When I came in here, I pushed them out, is what I'm saying. So, basically what happens is when somebody else uses it, yeah, you just keep bumping somebody else out. So then what happened to the... How did... Was there someone else in there when that Delay pushed out when he used the tablet? That's correct. He was not very nice. He was not I don't very want nice. to talk about it. You don't want to talk about it. Not Where currently. Did he don't did talk about it anymore. I don't know. He just basically back to the future. <laughs> it just disappeared. No idea. It just disappeared. Apparently, uh, may- maybe if he went back to wherever the location he was at when he entered the tablet. My calculations only show that this wherever this pocket dimension or whatever I'm trapped in only has enough space for two entities. Yeah. At a time. And they're in a big 25 by 25 by 25. So how did the me. guy who must not be named That's what's in the tablet get in the tablet with him? Okay. I don't know. Uh, potentially use it to resurrect some... Well, no, I mean, if... Yeah, if he didn't it, get popped out. Yeah, if you... Well, no, but... But, but it, I, um, I would assume that if you use it to resurrect somebody, you would have been connected to the individual that was um, resurrected. So it's not so first in, first out. Can... 
Can you tell me what the, what the tablet was when you found the tablet, is what he says. Tablet of Resurrection. It, it was a tablet of... See, it was something different when I found it. The item has the ability to kind of change its disguise of what it wants you to see. Sneaky! I found out Sneaky. it's very intelligent, and it has a range of a certain range that it is able to kind of read surface Sneaky. thoughts for what you're searching for. Ah, get my foil hat, darling. <laughs> Here, I've got one for me, too. <laughs> I can take the tablet, and I can just change bodies to whoever's talking at the time. That'd be hilarious, but you've never seen one. <laughs> We're not going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm confused. I don't, I don't do <laughs> so essentially, the tablet is yours. If something happens to you, of course, it'll change into kind of an amorphous state until someone else comes looking for a magical item, and when they find it, it'll appear to what is, whatever great riches or item they wish to find, sort of say... When I found it, it was a very large deck hourglass. Of cards, deck, of cards, deck of cards, deck of cards. It doesn't work cards. like that. <laughs> <laughs> very large hourglass. Mm-hmm. 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 Like a very large tiny hourglass. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so it enticed you, or it enticed him to mm-hmm. use it by being some kind of chromat, chromance, chronomancy. Yeah. He doesn't tool? want to talk about it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Did you also make advances that were unwanted against the grumpy other guy that used to share this box with you? No. He was just not friendly. No, he just, just wasn't friendly. He didn't like to speak. Apparently, he's very like awkward. Talk. It was very he, awkward. He was less friendly than that one? <laughs> I'm very friendly when you get to know me. He's All right, Squidward, chill. He, right. We can <laughs> How is it that I can hurt my ear from you yelling, yet you're not yelling in my ear? No. God, that's weird. It is. Okay. Let's talk to Celestina. Yeah, I don't see any other, like, Mm -hmm. option here. Is she still holding up the city? She's, you know, she's within the city. She has not left as of yet. But, like, the, I think what you were asking is, like, holding physically. Like, the tree? No, I think it was established either a couple episodes ago when you guys came back. Like, everything has already been put into place as stable as there. Okay, okay, okay. But she's kind of going around doing what she can to either shore up the city or help. That's what she would have been doing as you guys left. Um, I will. (coughs) Wait, we're back at the city. Is she close? You can make a survival check to find her. You can make a perception. Yeah, or you can, can have do... advantage on your survival check. Okay, I will help you. Track her down. Okay, that's better this time. Twenty-three. Uh, I okay. I'm gonna. So who's going? Who wants to go with you? Is the entire party going with you? Or I guess definitely me and I'm on. We're off to see the druid. Yeah. You okay. tag along. Yeah. Sure. See so you lead. You lead, and it's sure. gonna take about an hour to track her down. But you finally do find her as she's kind of packing and getting ready to head back in the eastern direction where her homestead is. So oh, great and powerful druid. She kind of smiles. Smiles a little bit. I'm so happy I caught you before. You're obviously packing. Don't forget to bring like nine pairs of underpants. You never know. Um, can you talk to Imon and all at all included in there and see if maybe you can make some sense out of what is happening. We're all baffled. I'm going to go up to Celsi and be like, I didn't realize it was you, but I'm so excited to meet you. Okay. It's nice to meet you, (laughs) too. The Wardens, my hometown, Flurry of Blizzard. Insight check. God, I don't like them. Well, she didn't like Lorian. 17. She's very caught off guard when you say that. She says, what do you know of the Guardians? And it's a long story, but... Well, that basic, one's got one of them in his head. Right. Basic, yeah. Yep. Um, Can you guess? Is, is, oh. um, Her demeanor definitely changes to I, disgust and like a no surprise look. Like, oh, my God. <laughs> no, no, no. Just listen. Listen. Um, you know... We just r- really mostly looking for help for our friend, like, so, you know. So her backpack that was on her shoulder just kind of to the ground as she's going to, like, <sighs> sit down and cross her legs, like, listening. Story time. Yeah. Well, um, yeah, basically, um, 
Ivy's dead after, you know, we convinced you to help everything out. I got, you know, murked. Murk. Murk. <laughs> um, <laughs> a little bit of light. Murder. Got kind of stabbed by a giant boar. Me too, stinger. actually. It was great. Yeah, it was um, I was so happy, spotty. content, and then um, apparently oh, uh, <laughs> Delayeth um, resurrected me using this tablet, and um, he got sucked in, I got resurrected, and now I have both Delayeth and um, Lorian speaking to me in my head because they're both apparently stuck in the tablet. It's great. He's being facetious. I'm sure it's his fault is what she's going to say. Don't, it's not my fault is what you hear. Did you want to be it, dead? <sighs> huh? What? You said you were all nice and happy. Did you want to be dead? He was content. He was ready to... He's, I mean, he if was I, uh, resting. Yeah, I mean, Did we fuck it up. <laughs> no, it, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Brought we him back brought to him the back shit show. Too, yeah. um, <laughs> brought him back to this. What else would you want? Congratulations, <laughs> you played yourself. It, it wasn't entirely Lorian's fault on what caused this. This item has existed since before Lorian and, and the surge and, and everything. Don't know who created it, but um, he was tinkering with it. Got himself mm-hmm. stuck. That's what Celestine will say. Yeah, got himself stuck. Um, there, there was someone else in there before Delayeth resurrected me, and when Delayeth resurrected me, the other dude got pushed out of it. Somewhere. Yeah, it was where. Yeah. Sounds like a very complex problem, that's what she says. Yeah, I'm less worried about that, and... and, and what do you mean you're less worried about that? <laughs> Shut up, Lorian. I'm less worried about that <laughs> I love this. than I am about, like... The demon monster thing. Yeah! That needs to be sealed away. Yeah, which apparently you had a large part of doing previously. Yeah, and it wasn't easy. And I was much younger, is what she says. Mm-hmm. You don't um, need to today, darling. <coughs> well, thank you, is what she says. Why so, is that? Damn, I live in the Fae, is what she says. <laughs> Things age much slower here than outside the Fae. This okay. is why I chose to live here. But why is Flurry of Blizzard still kicking around? He's gotta be like 900. And 7. <laughs> <laughs> nice. 905, um, thanks. <laughs> I don't know why he's still kicking around. We just thought he was too stubborn to die. It, he's very stubborn, for sure. This Lorian... Did you have something to do with that? I told you I like to tinker with uh, things. It's because of Lorian. He's a cat. Okay. Something. <laughs> Nox is like, he's a Maybe. cat, come on! <laughs> cat, it's easy! Obvious. Do the math. <laughs> Don't agent. follow the red herring. Just, <laughs> like it's just simple. <laughs> normal no. speed. Okay. So, I see. Yeah. I'm, does I'm he have this old. power to bestow on others? Well, it does, n- not while he's in my head. That's rude. That's correct. Both rude and not while I'm in your head. <laughs> <laughs> no, sorry, I can't do it. I, I believe I that I this time <laughs> forever. <laughs> I believe that I live Listen, forever. Listen, I've created some artifacts with some help from a friend of mine. And I distributed to the wardens. <clears throat> that basically will slow down the aging process. But with the, some, some, some artifacts that slow down aging process. But with the but, magics being in flux, this okay. could be a problem. Mm, so they might die very quickly, very soon. Is Blizzard gonna like just shrivel away and blow away in the blizzard? <laughs> blizzard blowing away in the blizzard. Mm-hmm. It's, it's possible. Avalanche. Tell her, tell her to stick to No, Avalanche job. is another one. <laughs> um, it's possible. I'm not going to repeat what exactly Lorian said, but it's possible. Hmm. That's ominous. He's, he's we, should, we should go help him. No, he was just being a dick. Mm. That mm. sounds like the Lorian that I know. That's what Celestine is going to say. Um, yes, I chose to live in the Fae to protect the gate and to protect the Fae. And the Fae time <coughs> is much slower. So days in here equal months beyond the Fae. We've been away from home for years. So was this the Gatewell thing that it, like, erupted? It was, is what she says. Do we have one um, in the northern continent? 
Was that why Blizzard went there? Oh, cool. Cool. Like, just my mouth. Is that so did the tablet just come from the Fae, and now that's why it felt like 100 So she looks and she says, sit down, children. Sit down. Oh, it's I story need time. relativity training, please. <laughs> So after we sealed away these creatures, each one of us chose to find a place on a continent that we could protect where they were sealed to make sure that they were not unsealed, is what she'll say. So I chose to stay here. God knows what happened to Tenant. I have no idea, is what she says. He sounds like <laughs> Flurry of, Flurry of Blizzard is in the north to protect its gate. But there's not a monster there, hidden, sealed away in my mountain. Not currently. Oh, thank God. <clears throat> Almasith was in the Scaled Islands. Okay. Or supposed to be. He's a little flighty from time to time. Albus chose to stay on the main continent. Volteratus. Lorian, well, you'll get to find that out, is what she says. Mm-hmm. Currently, he's stuck in a 25 by 25 foot room. So. With me, help! Which you'll hear. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, <laughs> Delay. I'm sorry that you're stuck in there. We'll figure something out. <laughs> yes, we were able to seal these creatures away. We used the power of. The weave using the wells <laughs> to seal them away <laughs> with our combined magics. But I do feel as if sealing them away this time is going to be much more challenging. Well, apparently, there's a prophecy. If you heard about if you heard anything about a prophecy. I've heard a lot of prophecies, is what she says. So been I've been around for years. a long time. This one was like about an aunt and well, an uncle. There is a prophecy about Twilight the Great who banished the Prince of Demons, or will banish the Prince of Demons. Weird multiversal timey wimey stuff, I guess. Timey wimey. I love it. From you know, Lori and the The name sounds. <laughs> the name sounds familiar, but. As far as being Twilight the Great, but I don't know anything about this being part of a prophecy, is what she says. Wait, it sounds familiar to you? So was there a Twilight the Great in the past? The name sounds familiar from possibly some sort of research or something I've done. <coughs> Previously, is what she says. So is this Twilight like a reincarnation of a previous Twilight? Or were they like soothsayers in the future? Who has the journal, by the way? Uh, Which journal? The one that was given to the small little... I think they kept it. No, No, we got another one. Correct, it's a small little journal. Oh, that's right. The, um... um, Oh, that... Yeah. um, don't know who it was handed to. It might have been me, but I don't... Because I don't remember who it was that asked for it. I got the finger. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's how it gave you the finger. All I have is that Auntie gave us the bottle of Universal Solid in another journal. So, so I right. guess... Well, Ilias has uh, it. Him. Ilias has it. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> so, Ilias, when you... When this, you know, all goes... You know, we're having this conversation or whatever, you will feel kind of a twinge of magic from wherever you keep this journal. I'm a pouch bag. or a bag. Sure. Yeah. You kind of feel the need to check it. It's like buzzing. It's got a little, like... You get a text message. Pull it out and be like, hmm, book. Okay. <laughs> First thing that happens is a sad face. Followed by. Oh no! Hello. Oh, sad faces are logo. Sad, yeah, sad faces. Oh, oh, that was the safe word. Yeah, those are safe words. Hello, Team friends. Time. Today we foiled another attempted drug deal, and I gathered some fairy dust for you. Yes. Yes. As, as promised. <laughs> I wouldn't take or I wouldn't Come take on, it gosh. if I were you, but we ended up with quite a weight of it. Trinket continues to work on her magic, and we haven't had another teleportation mishap since we last met. I wrote a melody about our time with you, and apparently it was disturbing. When I have <laughs> lyrics for it, I will send them. Lots of love and kisses, uncle. Lots of Aww. X's. Nine X's. And nine. then 
every one of the eyes have a little heart about them. Oh my goodness! Now we have to write them back. It's one for each of my lives. After that (laughs) appears, there's going to be an elaborate drawing of Twilight with the wand or staff. Because remember the whole gag with looks like a wand? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we got it. Yep. I won't have shared the message. I won't let everyone read the message. We have to tell Uncle about the Wardens of Solaris and how we like know all of them and like all the fun things that have been happening. And that was really from her. That's amazing. <laughs> Somebody's gonna have to write her a real letter. Yep. Yay! That is awesome. Um okay. Well, it does not really uh Big on her letters. <laughs> no. Are are we done here? Can I go? I have a lot of research to do now that this oh, yeah, sorry. demigod is. Oh, I suppose. So what do yeah, we need to on do, loose? Celestina? Are you going to take care of this? Uh, no. I'm much too old for that. This is a young young person's game. I'm yeah. not a young person. And he said that we have our own part to play in this prophecy of. Anti, you say. Yes. Yes. Andy. That, that name I know. You know that name. I, yeah, it's like it's I a do. name name, not like your auntie. I do. Mm. And you'll hear in your head, oh boy, it's what you're going to hear. Oh, say more. Is this like Please good, share with the you class. Know auntie or like a bad you know and, auntie? <laughs> no, it's a good, but it's another timey wimey, as you put it. Hmm, long story. Oh no, what happened? A wizard or sorcerer or artificer or something like that is what she says. Uh, I mean, yeah, sorcerer. Uh, you should be... probably ask Lori, and he probably would know more. Holding out on us? I don't want to talk about it, is what you hear. Uh, okay, okay, I, I need. if you don't want to talk about delayeth. it. Delayeth. Strangling. Gladly, that's what you hear. <laughs> oh, hey, get off me! Get your hands off me! Couple stop good shakes. No, stop! Ow, that's my arm! Oh. Uh, Are willing to talk? Mm-hmm. Maybe. <laughs> I, that, that worked, apparently. Oh, good, good. I knew I loved Alea. Mm-hmm. You're such a great so role two, model teacher. The two of them had worked together as like an apprentice kind of thing. On creating artifacts and items. Mm. So was Lori and Auntie's apprentice? No. Tell, tell <laughs> her no. He was my apprentice. I think so. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's great. Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> based, on, based on his reaction, I think so. Oh, that's great. Uncle will be so happy to know that Auntie is like this great, powerful, like, chronomancer, tinkerer. So essentially, yes, there, there are some ties there. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Well, Andy is the one that told us about the prophecy. Well, it's good that he's still alive. I liked him. Yes. Um, but his, his boyfriend said. Yes. Mm-hmm. His, his I thought he was like supposed dead or almost dead. I'm missing an action. Okay, yeah. Right, MIA. MIA. <laughs> Possibly. Yeah, yeah. Day- <laughs> yeah. You're referring to Daybreak? Daybreak, yes. That is sad. He was also another f- favorite of mine. So you don't know where he is. And you don't know Uncle Ooh. and Twilight. Daybreak. I have no idea who this Uncle and Twilight are. Huh. Daybreak I haven't talked to in years. Mm-hmm. And I didn't even know Auntie was still alive. Daybreak went to another realm, multiverse, Correct. and then um, never returned. Correct. Mm-hmm. This was an obsession of both Auntie okay. and Lorian. Oh. Hmm. The possibility of multiple layers or versions of oneself. I think it's a bunch of BS. Well, considering we've met yes, the an other alternate version. version of Anti. And the alternate version of Daybreak. Yeah. Still don't believe it. She stands up. Would you like to <laughs> see the message they just sent me? <laughs> I mean, you can show me a message, but it could be magic foolery for all I'm aware of. Have you met her before? <laughs> Yes. Um, I, I, yes. So, um, what can we do to help you? To I'm going to go do some research and see what damage has been dealt to the Fae. I would encourage you all to 
do some research and soul searching yourself because I'm this creature like that. is quite powerful. Very big on mind games and mental Notice that. mental battling to wear you down. He's been known to like basically just exhaust people to death. Sweet dreams are made of these. <laughs> More like nightmares is what she mm. says. I'm still really liking the um, going back to my mountain where there is not something horrible sealed underneath it. Just saying. <clears throat> Soul search. Um, it's a great peaceful retreat. Once you have my control. staff. You know how to find me, is what she looks to Ilias and says. Yep. I'm going to go unless you have more questions. Now is your time to ask point. them. <laughs> um, uh, are we expected to like fight in this thing coming forward? And like, how do we train to get more powerful? Or are we just like like the nice like, side character that doesn't mm -hmm. die? Hmm. No, we're the, the, the initial, like, run in, we get wiped Leroy out with someone Jenkins. else. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to need a montage before we get this final boss. Um, I yeah. would definitely practice your skills. I would definitely find ways and items and artifacts that can combat against the Prince of Demons, is what she says. What's the Prince of Demons weak to? I... Love and kindness. Hmm. We have a ton of that. Divine, divine energies. Oh, good. I've recently started to... <clears throat> Seeing that he is a demon, or the prince of. Hmm. So Sunshine. Got it. Shield, your, shield your minds sun. and, you know, <sighs> gather your faiths. Let me just research a little bit. Um... <clears throat> I like it. I like it. Um, this is great. Do you think it'd be worth our time to try to find ways to find these additional wardens? Well, if there are any, if you're them? looking for magical items or artifacts, you might want to locate Tenet. Wherever he is, I don't know. When's the last location? Even he if pops, was... he comes up here in the Fey every once in a while, but he doesn't really disclose his information on where he is. What? What is Tenet? A human? A... He's a human. When you want to get in contact with him, what do you do? I don't. He just finds me. Hmm. Lovely. What are the reasons he's found you recently? I haven't spoken to him in years. Hmm. Lovely. Does he have any family or friends or loved ones or... I'll be dead. Mm-hmm. I mean, if he's messing with time, he might say something. She's very hesitant when you ask that. She's, she wants to say something, but she keeps her mouth closed. Um, this, I mean, I know, I know, you know, the magnitude of this situation and we are meek and weary travelers. I know that he has a wife, but that's the extent that he's divulged to me. He's very reserved to himself. Okay. And where... Wait. It took you that Wait. long? We're it like took me hour. that long. <laughs> You're an yes, hour into this? Did. Oh my god. Man. <laughs> Woo! I'm gonna make you guys do homework and start watching these episodes before you come back here. And literally, I was like, Tenet. You know what it was? Because I was like, David Tenet. And mm -hmm. then I was like, wait a second! Mm -hmm. uh, so let me share. R class. Runa doesn't know. Because it wasn't Runa. That's right. It and wasn't. now I have control of the one who does! You did this on purpose. <laughs> She's off tonguing the queen down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Refer to side quest with the cat and the queen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. <laughs> so where did? Where, like, where is he from? Where, like, where would his wife be? Maybe, possibly, any kind of inkling. I, I really don't know. Lorian? No. Mm, no, he's an elusive fuck. He also likes he's to hoard elusive. all the objects of magic. Likes Ooh, to hoard okay. Can you magic. can you draw? Delayeth one of these objects on the walls here and maybe give him an idea of what it looks like and then maybe we can like try to locate that object magically through magic using magic <laughs> with, with magic are you sure it's magic all right <laughs> like maybe like an idea an, an item he would covet so so the problem is that's it 
locating a, a specific object, mm-hmm. you generally need to be like somewhat close. Bingo. That's what you'll hear him say in your head. <coughs> I mean, so, so like we would have to be like, thingy. basically he'd have to be within like you know, a couple thousand feet of here. Oh, there's hope for this one. That's a pretty I good don't radius. Need your condensation, this is equipping, so kind of sending. Just sick to lay up on him every time you want him to. No, oh, it's okay. Put that away. <laughs> I'll, I'll be quiet. Nox has started drinking. Nox <laughs> <laughs> is in the cups. Literally <laughs> changed into together. different Nox. <laughs> I just, I don't know. Um. Okay. Well, I mean, can we sword. like? I don't think that that's necessarily still a bad plan if we can maybe get to a not last known location, possibly. Or something like that, but I don't know. If someone doesn't to want to be found, people. they don't want to be found, is what she says. Could if Syndra have any idea, or could Syndra talk to? They've got like a spy network everywhere, this? right? Who is connected? Al- if Syndra knows Albus, which Albus is a little closer to Tenet than I am. Ah, oh, there we go. Hey, okay, so we'll go find Albus. Where's Albus? Well, I mean, Don't we've got. They? Oh, he's in the. Let's not find Albus. Yeah, I'll send something in the sending zone. Like, <laughs> help. Let's play Zelda. We need to find sending someone zone. in Tenet. How do we find them? Okay. Click. <laughs> okay. Send. That's it, but we won't hear anything for either. We might hear something for a day, but we won't be able to respond back anyway, so. Well, so uh, this has been great, but I am getting a little sleepy. Yes, I had a long journey and a lot of research and things. Where uh, could we find you? Where are you doing research? I'm wondering. At my compound. Oh, with she has the staff. She has the staff. He's got the staff. He, yes. He, he. Correct. Hey, can't you tell by my fabulous beard? Yes. <laughs> Sorry, we need visuals to make sure. We gotta I'm get some be props. Next time, don't worry. <laughs> Amazing. You start plucking it. Um, oh my god. Okay. So make me a pillow. Well. Okay. So yeah. let's mm-hmm. get some rest. Mm-hmm. And then okay, Celestine, so I'll take her leave. Yes. Bye, I love you. She saw her exit and got the hell out. That's there. it. <laughs> let's go. Let's get some rest, and then we will. Thanks for holding the city up and everything. To figure that whole ordeal out. We also okay. need to determine whether or not there's any. Well, we probably need to talk to the queen and determine whether or not there's any threats from the betrayers at this point anymore because we gotta go talk to the queen and see how uh, <clears throat> she may not have some time may not have well, any time for us Flakes, Flakes is to talk to the queen so I know it's a great just idea go meet up with Flakes and see you know what went okay but let's walk slowly they need time to bask yeah in each other's glow I was gonna say we could do that or take a nap more. and then talk Take yeah. a nap and then, and then. I don't know. I feel like we should. Where's this palace? Is that? Do we stay at? The, does the we palace have enough? We, we, we were staying at a manor, which who knows whether. Or not okay, but that's when we were still. like just like little lowly errand boys. Now we're like saviors of the realm. I feel like we should be able to stay uh, in. We haven't saved um, anything yet. Well, if you remember correctly, you guys were taking up lodging in a small, kind of like, refugee camp, like a tent camp. Oh yeah. Whoa. Well, yeah. When you guys were resurrected, that's kind of where they had put you up because yeah. most of the buildings, the buildings have, been have been destroyed. Correct. So you probably just so. go back to that camp. Yeah. What? So, yeah, let's head I back really to the camp. camp. Let's. Yeah, well, cots aren't as sturdy. Not at all. Bed rolls. Mm-mm. Okay, so you guys will make your way back to the camp. Ooh, you guys yes. will grab a meal for the evening, mm-hmm. settle down, find your tents. Settle in for the night, get your long rest in, and I think this looks like a perfect place to reach the end of this chapter of our tale and let you digest what you just heard and saw. <laughs> Thanks for watching, Creating Grin. Click that subscribe button down below. Smash that bell button to keep up to date on the newest episodes. Leave us a comment, thumbs up the video, do the things. Uh, if you can't watch the newest episode when it releases, fret not. We got you covered. Just follow us on your favorite podcast provider. You can check us out on our socials, Facebook, Instagram, threads, uh, at crit underscore eating, 
underscore grin. And we're also on TikTok at creating grin all one word. Until next time, keep grinning. Bye. Bye. Bye.